everyone, Papa Red. Part two. It is Wednesday morning, 2.30 a.m. We are about ready. I'm getting ready to go over and pick up my buddy, and we are going to start heading up to Fremont, Wisconsin. And you guys are going to get part two of the uh, the Wolf Bass, Wolf River White Bass video. And um, we got a little bit of a drive ahead of us, but we're heading north, north of the border, and uh, we're going to try out some lures. We're going to try out our, our Wolf River White Bass Express lure. Uh, got a couple guys that are up there now already. They did pretty well yesterday. So hopefully, I know they weren't using lures, they were using some spinners, and they were using some uh, split shots and uh, minnows, but uh, they did pretty well. So I'd say there's a pretty pretty fair chance that we're going to get something on the on the lure we built, but we'll definitely get some, uh, some good fish and footage for you guys. But uh, I'm going to go pick him up, and we're going to get on the road. So hey, Papa Red, we are heading up north. We're here. We are on the Mighty Wolf River. It's Papa Red. I'm out here with my buddy Jeremy in the back. He already caught the first fish of the day. He's doing a, a minnow with a gold hook and a split shot. I've got uh, I got the Papa Red special on the line. So we're going to give this thing a shot. Not sure how it's going to work. We'll see what happens here. It's not in our preferred spot, but we'll get to it. So let's give this thing a shot and see what we can do. All right. Well, we're out on the river and. Uh, I'm about six casts in, and you guys can see. There's the Papa Red uh, White Bass Express and the first white bass of the day. So we're gonna call this a success, and we're gonna be using this for a lot today. See if we can keep it up. Dude, another one came up and hit it. Yeah. Thanks.
All right, it's three o'clock in the afternoon on Thursday. We just came in, that's our spot right over there. We just came in, take a little bit of a rest. We're gonna clean these fish. We've got 39 today that we kept, probably threw back another 10, 12. So we're right around 50 fish halfway through the day. So we're gonna clean these things up and uh, take a rest and head back out. So I just wanna take a minute and I wanna show you guys if you've never been to, Wolf, to the Wolf River in uh, in Wisconsin, this is uh, what you're missing. Wolf River in the spring, it's absolutely gorgeous. Anyway, you ever looking for a, a good fishing trip, you might want to look into this. There's the Papa Red Fishing Machine, 1985 C-Nymph. So we've already got some boats going. It's gonna be a good day on the wall. So, everyone make sure you stay with us. We're gonna get some footage of uh, some pretty good serious white bass catching action today. I'm feeling really good about today. Yesterday was pretty good. Like I said, we got about 50. Uh, I can see more in our future today. It's going to be a great day. Many will fit my live well. officially out of minnows. Time to go clean some fish. What a morning. All right, it's about two o'clock Friday afternoon. We've been out right over there since this morning at about eight o'clock and I'm not even joking you've seen the, uh, the footage it was almost every single cast I've had good years here before I really have last year was phenomenal in the same spot but uh, we probably kept I mean our live was full we probably kept maybe 80 fish and probably threw back just as many um, it, it was unbelievable we ran out of minnows one of the main reasons we came in. They did start hitting on some spinners, but uh, we're gonna eat some lunch. And uh, I don't know how much more footage I'm gonna be putting on this video. Um, 
to try and just make it interesting. I mean, it was just fish after fish after fish. So, anyway, we're gonna start cleaning these fish. We're gonna eat some hot dogs, clean some fish, and, and uh, probably head back out tonight. So, see you in a bit. All right, well, there you have it. That's the uh, that's my trip to the Wolf River in Fremont, Wisconsin. Um, we had a blast, an absolute blast. Um, the White Bass Express fared okay. Um, to be totally honest with you, live minnows were the ticket this year. And there's years that that's the way it goes. One thing will work and you're, you're going to struggle if you have to try and, you know, if you really want to try and make something else work. Uh, we caught a few on some of the Demon Spinners. I caught a few on the, the White Bass Express. Um, if the, uh, I, I believe that if it's a year where they're hitting artificials, um, when I happen to be there, to be totally honest with you, I think next week um, they're going to be hitting on just about anything. And I think that, uh, you know, the White Bass Express would, would do very well. Uh, if I did it again, I think I would uh, design the, the lure a little bit longer and narrower rather than, uh, you know, bait fish style crankbait. Uh, I think it'd be more of a, a Rapala style lure, a little longer. Um, but uh, I'm happy with it. I, I, I caught fish on it. Um, we had a great time. As you saw, we just we hit a school and we were just pounding them one after the other. Between the four of us that were up there, we probably caught uh, close to a thousand fish. I mean, it was absolutely insane. We came home with four bags of fillets. We're gonna have a real nice fish fry tomorrow uh, for Memorial Day, and we'll have quite a few more throughout the year. But uh, it was just a, a fantastic time. So anyway, uh, I just want to thank you guys for coming along with me again. Uh, it was a great trip up to Wolf River this year again. Uh, if you guys like this content, please do me a favor and hit that subscribe button. If you already haven't, uh, hit the like button, leave some comments. I'd love to hear what you guys think. If you've been to the Wolf, share some stories. Uh, but uh, anyway, until next time, this is uh, Papa Red, out.